also earned the shot. His bats are as loud as any slugger, including Shohei. When it comes down to sound off the bat, down on Motor Island, Patrick, I can be give you testimony of this. He bat plays well. He draws well to every part of the field. Very fast base runner. Who would have thought that? And not making the team under spring training helped him to go down to the alternate site, find the swing, and convince everybody, guys, I belong on a big league team. To me, he says three outstanding outfitters. And he throws at different arm angles. He's got a whiff percentage of 50 with his slider, 48.8 with his changeup. And we know he can throw 95 to 99 with his fastball. The consistency, his ERA in the second half, 1.37. When you kept hearing his name potentially being traded, that always plays in your mind. But I'll tell you what, watch the show from last year, both on the offensive side, running the bases, and above all, his defensive plays. And, I mean, he's really, from all three outfield positions, we saw him, but his driving the baseball, the grand slam he hit in Detroit, going the other way, showing that great power, but I love his routes in the outfield. You go back to what he did last year, 161, with 55 strikeouts and 124 at-bats. This season, though, 246 with 26 RBIs. Four home runs, slugging over 400. Outfield, throwing accuracy. And then he was clutch in so many ways. I mean, at one point, he was leading the Angels in RBIs for about a month. He wanted the baseball in the outfield. The routes were outstanding. He could play each corner and play it well. And there's a time in which, defensively, the ball needed to find Joe Adele for those purposeful reasons. Now, also against fastballs. That fastball up was not gaining on him anymore. Every single thing he was given to go out there and check on the box. I mean, uh, Fletch is right up there to me, for me, I'm biased, on a platinum glove. He is one of the top defenders in the league, let alone second base. Gold glove has to be his. He's done everything in his power, from coverage to batter's tendencies to accuracy with that arm to helping the guys next to him. And then even with the outfielders, get the ball to me on those relays, and I'll go out there and get it done. To me, no-brainer, Fletch continues to be a guy for so many reasons, even though he's struggling right now with a bat, is the top defender. He now is fifth best in all of baseball among second basemen, third best in the American League, but also his fielding percentage is better than Whit Merrifield, the guy that everyone thinks is going to be his, his toughest you know, competitor as far as the gold glove. 84 double plays turned. There's no one better, as far as my opinion, turning a double play, how quick he is on the transfer, how he gets to that baseball out of his glove. And Joe Madden has put him in so many demanding positions this season where he's